want to say how exciting it is to see these bright, shiny faces and recognizing themselves in these career role models and giving them the opportunity to dream. Hoping to inspire the next generation of women into the field, the Girls in Aviation Day event is welcoming hundreds of Winnipeg girls to explore new heights for them in the aviation and aerospace industry. I joined the cadet, Air Cadets uh, group in Stonewall and um, I thought it would be interesting to learn more about the airplanes and stuff. The event is put together by Northern Spirit, the Winnipeg chapter of Women in Aviation International. It's also being held all around the world in other cities that have the chapters. It's important for people to understand that these careers are open for everybody in all races, genders, you know, all this. And it's also important for kids to realize that in our own province, right here in Winnipeg, we're so rich and diverse in careers in aviation and aerospace. I think aviation is something very important and that uh, either boys and girls should be able to do. And I'm very happy that girls are now taking chances to um, show the world that they're capable of doing anything that they want. Held at the Royal Aviation Museum of Western Canada, the event on Friday evening had the girls split into eight groups moving from station to station, engaging in hands-on activities and learning about different career paths directly from professionals. We really want to engage the girls to touch because then once you get the hands-on experience, then it gives you that confidence that you're not afraid to touch something because you don't know how it's going to work or if you're going to break it. Organizers say they were completely sold out. Around 240 children and 180 parents attended. I think the most important is to uh, to be curious, take a look and experience. That I think that would be a great experience. I want them to see that there's role models that they can look up to and um, other women in the industry, so they can talk to them about their experience and uh, just get exposure that they wouldn't normally get, like in in a school or a regular setting. They don't know any female pilots. Barbara Bowen from Manitoba Aerospace says there's a labor shortage in the aviation and aerospace field, and with women accounting for only about 4% of that workforce, it is important to them to ensure a steady flow of young women into the industry. We want to get those numbers up, right? We need to get those numbers up. In Winnipeg, Timmy Olatunde, City News. In one minute.